Welcome! In front of me I have Garmin for a runner 35 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to re receive the notifications from your phone on your watch, your, your watch needs to be paired with your phone via the uh, Garmin Connect application, uh, this one. Once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed for the notifications uh, to be able to basically send to your watch. And you can do it by uh, opening the app, the Garmin Connect application, tapping on more, uh, Garmin devices, selecting your for a runner 35, and then uh, waiting until the watch is done syncing. And sometimes you will get the notification on your phone that you uh, don't have required permissions for the notifications to work. And if you have that notification, tap on it and it will redirect you to the specific page. But if you don't see this no uh, notification, we can find this page. And to do it, close the app for now, uh, find the settings icon and tap on it. In settings, we need to find uh, on the older versions of Android, it's called uh, allow notification access and on the newer versions of Android it's called device and app notifications and you can do it by tapping on search and typing in uh, device and app notifications or allow notification access I have the newer version of Android so we have the device and app notifications tap on it tap on it again and it will bring you to this uh, page and basically we have the list of allowed and not allowed uh, applications and what we need to do is to find the Garmin Connect app, tap on it and tap on the switch next to allow notification access, then tap on allow and once this is enabled we can go back and open the Garmin Connect app. In the app we can tap on more, again tap on Garmin devices, select our uh, for a runner 35 and here we can tap on device settings smart notifications and right here we can customize the settings for our notifications and we have uh, two states of the watch we have during activity and not during activity during activity is is, is when you're um, recording an activity on your watch like running cycling and stuff like that and not during activity is anything else so if you're not recording activity it's gonna be then and we can enable and disable the notifications for that state of the watch we can also tap on show and decide on which types of notification notifications should be shown. And, uh, oh no, that's the alert we have shown here. And we have all notifications or calls only. And the alert allows you to select if, you, if the notification should have a vibration, tone, or tones and vibration. You can select both if you like to. Okay. And once you're done customizing the settings, go back to the uh, this page, to the device page, and you should see the message that settings were saved. The watch will sync with your a phone and at this point you should be able to receive the notifications so I'm gonna send myself a message on discord as you can see we got the message on our phone and also uh, on our watch and that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the android phone thank you for watching if you found this video helpful please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video